We're live this morning from Providence Stadium. You join us for this test match between West Indies and India. I'm Mike Atherton and with me in the commentary box today is Mel Jones, Ali Mitchell, Ian Healy and the Silver Fox himself, David Gower. Thanks Mike, always a pleasure to sit alongside you. I had an opportunity earlier to get down and check out the conditions for the day and it's looking very lush on top but you can Well, I'm not surprised. I think anyone would have batted first in these conditions. Likely the openers will be licking their lips. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for joining us. Welcome to this match between the West Indies and India. Please welcome the players and umpires as they take to the field. The umpire signals that we're ready to go. First ball of the innings about to be bowled. Wait. Doesn't beat the infield. A little late on that, no run scored. A bit of shape on the ball as they let it go through. Tailed just a little at the end as it went through to the keeper. Now there would have been a few hearts in mouths in the crowd, but somehow they managed to make their ground with the dive. Waiting. No runs on that occasion, got into position nicely just too early on the shot, couldn't find a gap. Obviously didn't like the look of that one, and just ignored it. Got right in behind it. End of the over. over. India, India for are none, none for none. For none. A new batter always likes to feel bat on ball early on as they bring a bit of energy to the crease. Seals, Seals coming on, obviously the hoping Indies. the pace will cause some trouble. No interest in that one from the batter. Seals will be wanting to hone in on a better line and length to make them play next time. Nice timing, good batting, won't get to the boundary. Got their head right in line with the ball, a beautiful strike there, down the ground. Getting nicely settled at the crease now, would have been really happy with that last shot. You can understand why on that line they thought it was safe to let it straight through to the keeper. A well-directed short ball sways out of the way.
collects that one, simple as you like, inside the ring. Didn't hit that well, very late playing that shot. Four India runs added in the over. Are India are none for four. Roach from the press box end. Yep, thick edge. Well bowled, but that's another super shot. Onto the front foot, presented the full face of the bat and got it into the gap and all the way to the rope. A wonderful delivery to get the edge. We've got to keep hammering away at that spot time and again. A little bit of wobble on that ball and it's safely taken by the keeper. Not enough on it to entice a shot though. Let's see if they can get the ball up into the slot like before. So crucial to follow up that last delivery and keep the batter under pressure. Wait. Couldn't get it through the field. No runs on that occasion, got into position nicely, just too early on the shot and couldn't find the gap. Obviously didn't like the look of that one and just ignored it. Just threw the shot too early. No interest in that one from the batter. Roach will be wanting to hone in on a better line and length to make them play next time. Four runs added there. India are none for eight. There'll be runs here. There'll be one run here for them. 